Hello and welcome to the channel. Welcome back to the channel. Uh, this is Grand Empress. Uh, a time travel, time travel survival. Holy crap! English is hard. Um, so this is the game. I I saw it. I think in the Steam Next Best or something. I popped up and I I looked at it. If you look at the Steam page, uh. This is either fixing to be the most amazing adventure I've ever been on, or, or it's not. Um, so we're going to time travel. Uh, we're going to do this. Granted, person exciting survival based building through time with solo developed by, uh, so solo developed by PBJBU2. Uh, and, uh, granted, person shines in gameplay variety and usual effect. It includes new exciting gameplay mechanics location. To achieve this, the game follows a mostly linear tech tree. Complete the induction 20 to 30 minutes to unlock the base build, right? So, uh, we're going to do new save one. We're going to play single player. Um, it says it's all single player. It says everything. Um, but it's like, holy shit. Wow. Okay. Just, just already the game looks amazing. Like, don't get me wrong. Like, I, it looked like it's it's some asset flips, and and I don't mean to say asset flips like it, it's a bad thing. Like, um, like you can go there. There, there is a reason that you you can go and pick up stuff, and you can. Uh, okay, well, you definitely want to grab that thing pretty soon. Um. Uh, and you can buy assets, and you you can do stuff on online and time travel to device. Damn it! Press G to view the tech tree. G to view the tech tree. Uh, just some rocks. Time travel device is damaged. One time emergency fix allows us to repair it using raw resources. Look around for rocks. Left click to pick them up. Ten are required. Okay, makes sense. So you have a nice tech tree. So. It's it is what it is. Like, don't get me wrong. I'm not gonna be like, oh no, it's an asset flipper. You can take generic assets if that's not your wheelhouse, and you can put a game together and you can build it. I just need to find rocks. I'm not. It said to pick up rocks. These these look like rocks. I can't seem to pick them up. Oh, okay. So they don't actually highlight. Okay. You just have to basically point at rocks and left click. It, it assumes that you're smart and realize that those are rocks. Um, and you pick them up. Okay, now I want to pick up the rocks. But you can't pick up all the rocks. So that that is, isn't, is you know. All right, so that is there. Go ahead, the G key to open the tech tree again. Uh, so one time, or fix, press I or V to open your inventory. Look at the bottom, see your hot bar, right click, tra time travel device equipped to one. Right click to emergency time travel. So we'll open our inventory. Uh, okay, so uh, repair it. Okay, so that's good. One time repair. I want more rocks. I might need. I, I might need rocks. I have a feeling that this is fixed to put me someplace I don't want to be. Uh, right click to use emergency time travel. So the idea here is is you're, you're time traveling, you have a time travel device, and you go from place to place, and you, and you go and do something. Um, and it's an interesting idea, and it's a freaking gorgeous game. Holy crap, this game is gorgeous. Now, granted, I'm playing on a... Oh, it's a fucking dinosaur. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, just, just, just hard F bomb. Sorry. Uh -huh. <laughs> I hate these guys. Oh, get it close. All right. <laughs> All right. So, like, oh, the game that, so I'm playing out of 2080 Ti, so, um, but I'm only, and most of my settings are, are fairly high. But Jesus, like, so we'll go here, look at my, my settings. So, uh, we're borderless, we're 120 max frames, maximum view distance, and high, 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 high. And, you know, I've turned off, uh, 
blur, bloom and motion blur because uh, they those usually upset me. Um, but just on high settings, uh, I don't I don't think I want to mess with the dinosaur. To be fair, um, just just so we're clear, I think messing with a dinosaur uh, is not a good plan. Uh, we need berries, even more rocks. Okay, so we need even more rocks. Technology complete. Uh, get even no. Oh. Throw rocks at dinosaurs to kill it. Then harvest this meat by left clicking with with a rock. Best to go for a smaller one like a Utah Raptor. Shift to dash in a. You're gonna you're gonna have me throw rocks at a dinosaur. Are you serious? This nowhere nowhere in the survival handbook on any game has it ever been. Hey, here's a good plan. Let's throw rocks at a freaking T Rex. This this is just so we're clear. This is a bad plan. Yo, ow, 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 a lot. Ow, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die a lot. I died. I I died a lot. Now I got no rocks. I knew this was a bad plan. No, Mr. Raptor, I'm sorry. No, oh, you got another friend over there. There's probably stuff in the water that's going to eat me. What is that shadow? What the? Oh, it's my death location. Like, what the hell is that thing? Oh, it's a U2 Raptor. So at least he's still kind of injured. From all the rocks I threw at his face. Can we dive down? No. All right, let me get some more rocks. Oh, I clicked off the screen. I need more rocks. What are these? Oh, God. That moved fast. I got berries. No, Mr. Raptor, I'm sorry. No, no. I don't know what I was thinking. Let me, let me get some more rocks. We'll chat again. You know, I have a time travel device. You would think I'd have something slightly better than, than, than a rock to throw at a dinosaur. You know, a ray gun. You know, you know, maybe a bolt action. You know, rifle or something. You know, just can't can't grab the flowers. It, and the sad part is, is it only told me I need eight rocks to kill the dinosaur. Oh my lord, that is a big dinosaur. Excuse me, Mr. Dinosaur. No, this is bad. You are fast. I died again. I'm not good at this game. Oh, this is not working. Right click to throw a rock. I don't under no. Oh. No. 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 Do do do. Oh, I'm gonna die again. Yeah, I died again. <laughs> it's just not going well. Well, I'm collecting death locations, so that's working out for me. Uh, obviously, like, so this is my first straight into the game, just to look at it, uh, and just to see uh, whether or not this is going to be worth it. Um, oh! Well, I think I think those are plant eaters. I, I, that one doesn't look like a plant eater. That one looks like a plant eater eater. All right, my food, my food is low. I got raptors everywhere. Let's see if I can pick up some, some rocks. Hey, look, somebody left these rocks all over the beach. 
wonder how that happened. See if I can climb on a rock or something and get away from these circles. I don't think I'm going to be able to get away from them that way, though. Maybe I can climb a tree and throw rocks at them. I think you have a stamina meter, but I don't think it actually shows you the stamina meter. Oh, no, it's over there. It's on the right side. It's, it's kind of a grayed out, like far, like a little lightning thing. So once it gets full, I think you're, yeah, that, that's how you can move. Okay, that makes sense. We got food. We got inventory over there. All right. So let's try this again. Because the last, like, four times have worked so well for me. So you can't charge, like, if you or like charge your attack like i was hoping to like right click and hold and then like when i got the aim right like freaking to whack it but yeah it, it didn't work i got the higher ground now you're in trouble he doesn't he, do, he does not believe so It's a pathing nightmare. Yeah, take that, you sucker fish. Why are you running away now? Where are you going? Come back here. Hit you in the butt with a rock. Oh, 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 you can't go underwater. And it gets, oh, that's even prettier. Now that I've got raw meat on me, I'm sure that won't that won't cause any problems whatsoever. Look, sir. I don't know what's going on over there, but I don't think I like it at all. Dinosaur meat. Uh throw oxy dinosaurs to kill it. Oh god. Taming dinosaurs. Find a Utah Raptor, the smallest dinosaur, and throw meat on it. It'll start liking you, and once it eats enough, it will tame and let you ride it. Oh my lord! Oh, this, this, this does not seem like a good plan. I got, I got his dead buddy, and then I throw him at his friend. That weird little raptor guy. <laughs> What is even this game? Oh, I'm already, I'm, I'm like 13 minutes into it. I've already died four times. I'm having the time of my life. It's amazing. Hey, Mr. Mr. Triceratops, uh, I think, I think we'll, we'll leave you be and let you, I think, I think those are plant eaters. Um, I don't know. I'm a, I'm a computer technician, not a di dinosaur technician. I do know, I do know that those like to eat people. And it's not that they like to eat people. They like to eat anything that they can eat. At least that's what I believe. Uh, so whatever it is, uh, I'm going to I'm going to go through I'm going to go throw meat at a dinosaur. I'll be right back. <laughs> those, those, those are words I've never thought I would say. Please, please like me. Oh, okay. Thank you. Thank you for liking me. Can can I can I pet you? Uh, enable wandering, enable follow, attack if attacked, unclaimed. Uh, okay. So, so you throw four pieces of meat at a dinosaur and then it's your friend. A time rift has been detected in an ancient cave. Oh, that, why is the screen shaking? So yeah, so that some of the assets like the the people like some of the assets aren't. All right. So first of all, this is a this is not a triple A game. Oh, this is a this is a single developer game. Uh, so the like it, it is what it is, right? It's a single person making a game. 
Uh, so if the game, if some of the assets don't look, you know, oh my God, it doesn't look polished. It's not a unique character. Like, I don't want to hear it. Like, it's the, the it's a single person making a video. Oh, good. I, I died. Uh, evidently my, uh, I was bleeding to death or something, I guess. Oh, that's nice. You're just going to sit there. All right, let's try this again. Uh, so anyway, so it's a single person making a game. It's a single developer. Uh, so if, if it, you know, it's not going to be perfect, but it's a fucking amazing idea. It is an awesome idea. And, like, as far as I can tell, uh, the game works. Like, I haven't, you know, it's not been a buggy mess. I've been able to load in. I, I've made it through at least the first, you know, 15 minutes. Um, like, could it could it be better? Sure. Is it is it the best, you know, thing ever? No, it's not going to be. It's, it's, a, it's an indie game. And I'm fine with that. Uh, but it works. And hell, I've been playing it for 10 minutes, you know, 15 minutes, and I already think I got my money out of it. Like, it could be fair. Like, like, what? Like, nice little time vortex. So we'll just run through the time vortex here. That should be fine. Can I take my dinosaur with me? Oh, I can't, I can't enter with my dinosaur. You can't unride here. Uh, can, can I tell you to follow me? Can you follow me through the following? Yeah, come on. Hey, come here. See the, see the little purple thing? Yeah, come on. Come on. Go through the purple thing, boy. Come on, boy. <laughs> I don't think my dinosaur is going to follow. He even starved to death because he's just waiting for me to come back now. Now I'm sad. Technology ancient cave complete. But yeah, so like seriously, like like the game is gorgeous. No matter what, the game the game is beautiful. It looks like a freaking tech demo. Uh, I, I have a feeling it wants me to follow that thing, but I'm kind of worried about following it. It's for the ancient temple of the unknown uh, time period to find what you can to recharge time travel device and travel to primitive, the primitive era. But the game is just... The game is beautiful. Like, seriously, the game is beautiful. Uh, the, some of the sound is a little bit loud. I've got it turned down to 30%. I did turn the music off uh, because uh, because YouTube. Um, so I don't know if the music is good or if that stuff is good as a general rule until I know for a fact that um, I'm not going to get in trouble with it. Uh, I have a tendency to turn music off for games uh, just because it's, it's, it's not worth it. I put, it, you know... How much effort I'm going to put in, and then you know, then I have to go through and, and rip the music out and stuff like that, and it's just it's a pain. Uh, and, and and I get DMCA's, and I'm not trying to be like, oh, you shouldn't, I should be able to use your. No, I get it. It's it's DMCA's. People have to have to uh, to protect their themselves and their their uh, creative artwork and stuff like that. And I get it. It's just, it sucks that uh, if you're using actual game music, some a lot, of, well, not a lot of times, but sometimes you can actually get uh, uh, claimed from using actual game. Uh, and honestly, is the reason I left YouTube for a long time uh, was because I lost, uh, I got three strikes on, on a single, single video uh, for a game that, the, the game was about the music. It was all about the music. Uh, and uh, I, I was assured that I had the rights. I had everything. And uh, I uploaded it and got three strikes on a single video. Who bets? 
Uh, it is a this is a gorgeous gorgeous game like it is I've got like fake walls to keep you from getting places though like places it doesn't want you to go so there are some issues about trying to go things but even even if these are all asset packs that you can pull off of the off of the a workshop or or something like that it's put together, it's made, it's made cohesive. Um, like me and Pete were talking about it, and I, I and I said in the beginning of it, this was either gonna be the most amazing thing I've ever played, um, or it's not. There, there's there's you know the the claims that this game makes and the, oh I'm, I guess I'm gonna go down here now. Uh this this may be bad. Um, I may have already got myself stuck. Can I crouch? Guess I'm going down here now. I uh, I walked over that thing and got stuck and couldn't get back up it. Uh, so I guess we're going out this way. Hopefully, I got everything in there I needed. So, C is the crouch. If you're trying to... Oh, this this doesn't look good. Uh, well, I guess I'm going out here now. Uh, I have now fallen out of the world. Uh, well, this has gone well. So, uh, this is an indie developer. Uh, it's uh, early access. Uh, <laughs> I think it's early access. Um, things can happen. <laughs> You think I may have broken it? Uh, I think I still, I think I'm still pulling. I think it's early access. Let me check. Let me check to see if it, if it actually labeled as early access. Oh, it's not labeled as early access. It's labeled as released. Um, let's see. Unstuck. Let's try unstuck. Okay, I get got all my stuff. All right, so there's an unstuck button. Uh, I highly recommend uh, keeping that handy and <laughs> not falling down the hole that I fell down. Uh, so I don't know what happened. Uh, I think I uh, I walked towards an edge that I could kind of squeeze through and then I couldn't get back up. But it, it, it's, like I said, I, I, I'm going to give it a, a pass on some things. It's a, being an indie a team, or, and then even more so being a, a single dev building something like this like I am not I'm not gonna crap on this guy's game I'm sorry I'm not going to um the uh the game the game is gorgeous it's it's worked so far the some of the mechanics it, it, it feels obviously you're on handrails you're, you're kind of you know but he's trying to set expectations and not trying to uh, you know, make people think that they're getting something they're not getting. Uh, but it is not like, if nothing else, just as like a, a novel, just to follow the story. Like, it, I'm I'm hoping for base building and being able to set up someplace, someplace, and do do a lot of, of crazy stuff later. Uh, there's a biplane. Oh, oh, oh. What kind of weird place is this? That, that's very loud and windy. Yeah, there's a biplane and a ship. Um, evidently I keep following freaking uh, pixie dust here. You better not be leading me to a trap, you, you crazy little bug. You lead me to a trap. I'm gonna, I'm gonna find you. There's a biplane. <laughs> There's like an old steamership. Like, like, what even is this game? Like, what? Like, I, like, I, I, I don't. I, I got. It, words are hard. 
but he, uh, oh, good. There, there's a rocket. There's a space rocket next to the biplane and the steamer ship. Um, and the weird cave where I'm following the bug. This is fine. This, this is fine. Okay. I, I'm, I'm good. I'm, I'm, I gotta go back. Uh, this, all right. I, I need a screenshot of that because no, nobody's gonna believe me. Oh, this this place seems okay. Here, can I take that too? Yeah, take that. Does it break it? It didn't break it. It's still it's still doing blue pulsy blue things. Uh, the the sprint uh, action where you hit that that gets a little strong. Uh, it's almost like a uh, like. A, like a time skip, like you're you're fast forwarding. Uh, so that part uh, is a little a little janky, a little weird because uh, you, you hit shift and you're expecting it to make you maybe run a little bit faster, and you like like jump, e charge the device, charge the time travel device. Crystal charges up to fully charge time travel device. Uh, use it to travel to the primitive era. Uh, I want to look around some more first, sir. I'm not just going to be like, oh, let's just all move to the, to the next area. I'm going to punch some pots. I played Zelda. I know I know what, what's in pots. What? Okay. Well, you're still going that way. Why are you still going that way? But just the, 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 the amount of stuff that the game has in it already... There's, there's a, oh, this is not the way, this is the way I came in. So that went this way, I think. Come here, bug. I could charge again. Nope, can't charge again. Um, is this back to, I don't think I can, I don't think I can follow you, my friend. So it's uh, basically an invisible wall. It's keeping me from going over there. So maybe at some point I'll be able to come back here. Equip and hot, right? Hold an available destination. Dinosaur error or the primitive error. <laughs> so we can go back to the dinosaur error. Oh my Lord, this doesn't seem safe. Okay, so you, you hold right click, you move to where you want, and then you hit left click. Okay, okay. I... New unlocks for this error. Open the tech tree to see what you do next. Okay. Uh, if you didn't like the way the dash and sprint controls work so far, you can enable alternative met method in the settings. Okay. Evidently, the game fucking can hear me. Technology mistress temple completed. All right. So settings. Uh, settings. Um, controls. Shift. Okay, so alternative dash and sprint method. We'll turn that on. Um, we'll back out of that. We'll close that. So escape doesn't work in that menu. So yeah, so then that turns it into a just a dash. Okay. All right. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I doubted you, developer. I don't know what I was thinking. <laughs> Jesus. Oh. So fiber technology is not yet unlocked. Okay, so equip a rock and use it to mine big rocks. <laughs> I like the sense of humor at least. Well, I like that you use rocks to get rocks. <laughs> All right, developer. All right, you got you. I, I'm 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 here for it. What whatever whatever this this trip is that we're going on, what whatever whatever adventure you have planned for me i'm here for it my friend like you you have you have you have made it like like seriously you are this as well punch some trees to get some logs collect some fibers to get some bushes all right okay i can't i can't rock a tree I'll 
Back to punching trees again. Does it hurt me when I do that? It does hurt me. You slowly do regenerate your health. Down in the bottom right, it's really hard to see. Uh, but there's like a little, like a band-aid sign. And uh, you see as I punch the tree, I, I'm taking damage. It will heal over time, it looks like. All right. Uh, start showing crafting table, torch. So you hold tab to get this. That's cool. Um, G. Uh, collect some fiber use from bushes. Left click with your hand. So somewhere there's a bush that I accidentally grabbed. Uh, bushes from our stuff from okay so we'll make a crafting table this looks good the last place I just randomly chose for my base worked out well uh, okay he constructed with a rock I, I, I literally just, okay, I just, just smack it with a rock. Access crafting. So we can make a pickaxe. Make a stone hatchet. We can make a stone spear. Okay. So I need to figure out how to get more bushes, which is easier said than done. I get do I get things from that? Nope. Um, I don't know which bushes I, I was supposed to grab. Maybe it's these. No. Nope. Maybe that bush. Come here, bush. Aha! I got fiber and berries. Oh, you can do it multiple times. I mean more fibers and berries. Yay, fiber and berries. Uh, okay. Any more bushes? There's a bush. Oh, that's a deep water. It's like the ditches in Texas. Yeah, I, I already, so now uh, let's, let's talk about <laughs> the, the claims that this game makes. Um, the claims that this game make is that uh, there's like, I don't know, battle mechs and vehicles and spaceships and Dyson spheres. Um, okay, I'm here for it. All right. All right. I'll, uh, we'll, uh, I'm here for it, Dev. Let's, let's, let's go down here and see what we can get. Um, so let's, oh, okay. Construct with a rock. The, uh, so there's a bunch of stuff that the game obviously uh, claims. Uh, there's a lot of stuff that uh, we're, you know, that that is in the the, the uh, stuff, and it looks like is there. I don't know. Like I, I, I those pictures had to come from someplace. Um, I, I'm gonna go find out. Like I'm gonna play through this game, and we're gonna have a series on it, and we're gonna go find out what's in this game. That's what's gonna happen. Um, uh, but. Yeah, so far. Oh, the wild boar. Uh, I need more rocks at fiber. Uh, so this this is a. Uh... So the trees just disappear. You can't do anything to them once they're down. Uh, doesn't look like the equipment takes damage. So far, unless the green bar around the outside is the damage. There's a repair mechanic in the game, so there's no repair there yet. It's a fox. Uh, four. Uh, eat. Consume. 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 
Et tu me dis. Et tu me dis. Et tu me dis. All right. Can I make... What do I need to make a campfire? Uh, probably rocks. I'm guessing... Nope, not, that's not a rock. It looks like a rock. Tastes like a rock. But it's not a rock! Uh, trying to find the actual rocks that I can hit or pick up. There seem to be like, yeah, like you have to have a certain size rock to be able to pick it up. Oh, okay. Physics, physics engine for the win. I got it. Yeah, so it seems like there's a certain size, like big rock you can do. Um, but the smaller ones you can't really do anything with. Like, because I can't grab them. I can't punch them. So you need to find a certain sized rock to be able to pick it up or to find stones to pick them up, it seems. Because, like, these, these you can't do anything with them. So that's not, not the best. Uh, campfire. I'm going to make a campfire. Let me guess. Beat it with a rock. Construct with a pickaxe. Okay. Eat a cooked meat. Cook raw animal meat. Campfire. Nope. Stick. Eat. Cook raw animal meat. Throw the dinosaur meat at it. All right. Evidently, we can't cook dinosaur meat. Is it, is it dinosaur meat or is this raw animal? Oh, it's dinosaur meat. Maybe we can't cook dinosaur meat? I was really looking forward to a dino burger. Just just saying. All right. Uh, what else am I supposed to be doing? Uh, let me go back to my G menu. Stone tools, craft yourself a mighty spear and perhaps a pickaxe and a hatchet. Raw animal meat. Right. All right. So planks, build a wood cutting table to process logs into planks. Okay. So hold down tab, wood cutting table. Uh, what do I need? I need more logs. Okay, that makes sense. That uh, checks out. Go with seven. So some of the controls are a little a little clunky. Uh, it, and it's just me trying to get used to the game. It's compared to other games in the genre that I played. Uh, I I won't say that this is a. It's. I I don't think at this point. This is a bad game. It seems to work. There seems to be a couple of little things uh, that, and, and things that, that I will forgive uh, seeing. And I keep saying it, but it's a single dev. It's a single person building a game. Um, I think they deserve a little bit. Now, I'm not saying that they should, you know, get a complete pass and, and I'm not going to give them one. Uh, they don't get nobody gets a complete pass. If it's if it's a, a crap game, it's a crap game. Um, and I, and I will call it as such and I will freaking make a video and I will, I'll never play it again, but I'm probably going to be playing this game a lot very soon. And that's, that's with me owning tectonic. Like this is different. Like this is, I want to see this is shiny and new and I want to see, uh, so, uh, we will, we will do that. Uh, eat hit with a hatchet. So it, it's an interesting idea. It's it's so we can we can start building shelters. We can build houses. Uh, we can build baskets. Uh, salted leather hide or dinosaur hide. So oh so I guess we're oh we're gonna go back and have a chat with the dinosaurs. You're saying <laughs> that's what I read there. Uh, leather armor is not yet unlocked. Uh, so then a timely upgrade technology is not upgraded. What's next? Uh, and then a rip to Egypt, uh, ancient relic. So there's a lot to do in the tech tree. 
Uh, so this is the dinosaur error, and then this is here. So primitive error. Oh, so so this is basically the tech tree to get us out of here, and then then there'll be more. I. As of right now, if you're trying to figure out if this game is worth it, I, I would say yeah. I would say rolling the dice on a, on a developer to, to see if if this is worth it, yes, please go do it. Uh, I'm going to uh, get this uploaded, uh, and we'll do that. If you want to see more content on this game, please go ahead, hit a like, uh, subscribe to the channel, to make sure that you come back. Uh, and then if you have a comment, question, or concern, please put those down below. Uh, but I will be uh, doing what I can to try to promote this guy as much as I can, along with all the other indie devs that we do, uh, and then we will go from there. So if that is the case, please do me a favor, uh, and uh, we will see you all next time. Y'all be safe. Talk to you soon.